I did a review on this uh, Mastercraft cordless grinder. Uh, the grinder is not too bad. The batteries do not waste your money if you value your money. But I, I don't. I got a uh, electric one, which I it's Mastercraft, and I got a Tack Life, which is really good. I do have bigger hammers. <laughs> Believe me, I got bigger hammers. I don't know why I always go for this thing. It's like we have a, a history together or something. hard-earned money. Well, granted, it does say the battery is low. Low, baby. Low. Alright, guys. I do hope that uh, you're having a good week. And, uh, I know, I was just uh, watching a fruit sales video, plasma cutter, and I was thinking, it would be nice to have one of those. What's the chances of Santa Claus? Maybe Bruce L can talk to Santa Claus, and I can get one too. <laughs> like a pretty good product you got there we'll see when he does a long-term review but uh, 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 uh. now crank her up crank her up wire speed four and a half I figure Put on some gloves for good measure. I got a auto darkening helmet from uh, Princess Auto, and it only lasted well no time. So I got these, and they seem to be all right. Now it's a little awkward here. Why I did that was because uh, uh, with this one, uh, I started welding. I never tested it. I started welding, the battery was gone, and uh, flashed myself pretty bad. Don't tell me I'm out of wire. And it blew through. Min one, min one. Not, yeah, so minimum one. So, uh, well, I can't go much, uh, much lower than that. I'm going to have to get, get the fuck out of my ass. I'm going to have to 
build that in somehow. The idea is to try and breed in as much of the smoke as you can. Still got a bit of filling in to do, folks. touch it up. I don't want for you guys to see my welds. You're not a welder unless you can, you can, you're a grinder first and then a welder after. See where I put my glasses? Now, let me show you what we got done here. You know, it's not a very complicated job, right? That's why I'm doing it. Uh, come on, camera work, camera work, man. Get get focused. There you go. Yeah, you can see where I finished off there, but over here, right there, I had to fill all that in. Not bad. I'll do the other side now. So, that's pretty much it. I just wanted to have a little video. Uh, somebody wanted to see, you know, the welder in action, which, you know, I'm not a welder, but a... Um, you know, that's uh, how it works. And uh, you can see on that setting, if you can focus in, it's only on the minimum it can go, and it's on three and a half, right? And it was blowing through that metal. I'm guessing this. Well, I don't know what that is. Let's measure it. Let's not guess. Let's not guess, folks. Let's... Because I know you guys are very precise people. 
You guys want to know exact, exact measurements. Yeah. Well, I'll give it to you. I'll try not to find a, a bin. Eight thousands. Eight thousand. Well, let's see what that is in. No. Let's go to millimeter. Let's go to Eon. So, 2.2 millimeters. Right? If that means something to you. So, yeah. So it is, you know, it's it's not real thick, but well, there's a lawnmower. And it blew through it. But uh, there is a bit of, a lot of rust in that area. So, you know, it just might have went through the rust. Anywho. I just wanted to show you that. I'm not going to videotape the other side. It's pretty, pretty simple. But, uh, but you know something? I I can stick weld a lot better than I can MIG weld, and, and I don't know why that is. I really don't. Um, it's just that MIG or uh, stick welding, you know, with this stuff. It, if that blew through it, it's only so low you can go with the stick welder anyway, right? So. But uh, yeah, I don't know why. I, I, I prefer stick welding compared to the MIG welding, but the MIG welding is a lot more convenient. You know, you don't, the consumables is there. You just got to call all wire and you just keep on going until it stops, right? Whereas, you know, you got to put in the rods and stuff like that. It does, uh, it does do a pretty good job. And uh, most of it anyway is uh, operator, so, right? Anyway, folks, uh, if you're new, subscribe. If not, still come back, and uh, we'll chew the fat. Anyway, stay safe, guys. Thanks.